Hey everybody, it is Monday, that is the next time for Crumble Cookies. And if you remember last week I said, hopefully not a lot of chocolate, but you know what? This week they did a ton of chocolate, so let's go get those cookies. Got them. Now we just gotta take them home, try them out. Okay everybody, first on our list this week is the Molten Lava Cake. This is a dark chocolate cookie with oozing hot fudge and sprinkled with powdered sugar. Second cookie on the week is the cookie dough cookie. This is a brown sugar cookie topped with cookie dough buttercream and chunks of cookie dough pieces. Third on our list this week, it's actually a chilled cookie. It's the chocolate pistachio cookie. This is a chocolate cookie with a pistachio filling topped with a little bit of whipped cream and a sprinkle of chopped pistachios. Next on our list is the chocolate peanut butter chip. This is a chocolate cookie packed with melty peanut butter chips. Last cookie for this week is the cake batter cookie. This is a cake batter cookie swirled with cake batter cream cheese frosting and mini cookie cake batter balls on top. Five was a bonus one this week. Uh, the pumpkin uh, batter like muffin one that we had last week actually was really full of chips this week. So I said, you know what? I'm going to give it a second shot. So I think it was the pumpkin with chocolate. I think so. So I say we just give that a quick nibble. Well, and see we'll how test that goes. it out. Yeah, we'll just test that one out again. Looks like there's definitely more chocolate chips in Cheers. this one. Mmm. Show the really great spice. I love Ooh. that one. I love that spice in that. Oh, the nutmeg, the mm -hmm. cinnamon. You can't go wrong with that one. Mm. No, but... That was just a quick taste. Now let's actually get to the ones this week. So what one do you want to start with? Oh, I'm on the wrong page. Let me get my list up here. What do you want to do? I mean, cake batter is probably going to be like cake batter. So I'm not expecting anything. So you want to do that one first? Different, yeah. Okay. So let's try cake batter. That one I'm excited for. I love cake batter. I got ice cream I mean, don't get stuff. me wrong. But there's a lot of things with cake batter. So. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. I mean, you put it up to your nose and you smell cake batter. Mm -hmm. mm, that was good. Mm. Super soft. I love how it looks on the inside. That's very yummy. festive. Very festive. Oh, I'm dropping crumbs. It's a very festive cookie. Kiddos would love this. Forget a birthday cake. Just get one of these. Yep. I'm tasting the cake batter balls. They're delicious. I mean, and, and the cream cheese frosting is mm, wonderful. Spot on like it always is for them. Mm. It is super yummy. I love the frosting. Can't Super flavorful. Uh-huh. You can't go wrong with the cream cheese. Cake batter cream cheese. Yeah. That's Check a good one. that out. I mean, cake batter. That's pretty good. That's lots of cake in there. Yep. I like but it. But I loved it. It was actually a really good cake batter cookie. So, color me surprised. I say for the next one, we go right to the one I'm not looking forward to the most. The pistachio. Yes. I am not a nut fan. Unless it's peanuts and it's got a creamy peanut. You know what's funny? I love pistachio, but ah. I, but I don't eat a lot of pistachio nuts. So no. no. But it's got cake. It's almost like a grasshopper cookie because it's got a, like that Oreo cake bottom. Well, we had and the, the mint one like two yeah. weeks ago, and that one was good. That one's really good, but you know, it kind of makes me nervous with real pistachios. Like, how do you go in with this? Maybe I'll just eat a real pistachio first. Not that bad. I like just the nuts. Yeah. No, fam, pistachio. No, no, that flavor is off putting to me. So that is not my favorite cookie. <coughs> I, I'm not, I don't hate it. I don't hate this cookie. I don't hate any cookie. No, I don't hate any of their cookies. Would I get this cookie again? No. Probably not. No, it's no. not my favorite of this week's. Um, I feel like there's too much of the the cookie. How how did they describe it? The the chocolate cookie. I feel like there's too much of that compared to the amount of pistachio whip topping that you get. Like it's a very thin amount that you get. So like here is my cookie compared to my whip topping. So I definitely am getting more chocolate cookie than I do of the pistachio, and I feel like that's what's overpowering it right now. So I really don't taste a lot of pistachio in that. I taste the pistachio, so, and that's why I'm not a big fan of it. 
because I don't like that flavor. I just never have. But eh, to each their own. I'm sure someone's going to go, I love someone's this Someone's going to love this cookie. Just not, not me. us. All right, which one next? We did that one. We did that one. We did that one. Let's do, oh, one. what is this one? It's the chocolate butter. peanut butter. Let's try that one. You love chocolate and peanut butter. <coughs> Let's I put do. them together. <coughs> I do. And it says it's bursting with melty peanut butter chips. I mean, check that out. The inside is, yes. Top, not so much. No, not so inside, much. Inside, yes. And we know there's no frosting. Uh-huh. I was just going to point that out. So, let's see how we do. Cheers. Mm, I like it. The cookie has some crunch to the top of it. Very fudgy. Make sure you have some milk nearby. That's very fudgy. It's like the Reese's peanut butter cup that came out that was like 90% chocolate with just 10% peanut butter. It is a lot I'm of chocolate. I'm getting a lot of chocolate. And it, you will recall last week I said, please, Crumble, don't overload us with chocolate this week. Chocolate chip cookie dough, molten chocolate lava cake, pistachio with chocolate pie, chocolate peanut butter. So four out of five is chocolate. What are you doing, Crumble? That's too much chocolate in a week. We got to have balance. We yeah. needed a fruit one this week. Yeah, cake batter is not fruit. And something and like apples or apples no. are good. I need a carrot cake. I, I need something from Little Debbie. Ooh, Give me a honey bun. I need, I need I need some tasty num nums. Carrot cake would be good this time of year. Yeah, I, I need something good. because There is a lot of chocolate. Too much chocolate there. in this peanut butter one. Not enough peanut butter. And you know how you could fix that? Peanut butter frosting. That would have fixed that one. Ooh, that's a good idea. Yep, that would have But whoever done. said there's too much chocolate? In this cookie, there definitely is. <laughs> this week was just a little bit too much chocolate. Yep, and we but, still got two more chocolate ones to try. Yes, but chocolate's good. All right, which one next? I am saving my milk for the molten lava one. Because right, so I feel like that one's going to be cookie dough. super fudgy. For the brown sugar <sighs> cookie. Look at the inside of this. I mean, check that out. That is like a um, mile high cookie dough with. I'll take it. Brown sugar cookie with a cookie dough buttercream, chunks of chocolate chip cookie dough, and chocolate chips. Here. I'm excited about this one. Mm. This one does not disappoint. Mmm. Oh, you can really taste that brown sugar in that cookie. Mm -hmm. mm. And the cookie dough. And the cookie dough. That one does not disappoint. That one's lovely. The cookie is very soft. It's thick, but so, it's very soft. Cookie, delicious. Mm. The icing is Frosting really good. Frosting or icing? Yes. And then a good accoutrement on top with the cookie dough ball. You've had three for three. That's a solid cookie. And that's what that's you need. Cookie. You need a good tasting cookie, something icing, and then something topping on top. That one was perfect. That was a really good cookie. That was a I love great cake cookie. batter stuff. And that, Ooh, that one was cookie good. Cookie dough was just great. That brown sugar, oh my gosh. It just hits you and it's like, mm, wonderful. Really yummy. That was. That was a good cookie. Last one for this week, the molten lava. Saving the milk for this one because it looks good. No icing, however, it's got the gooey middle. So and we will show you there is the gooey middle. So that should make up for it. So look at that. That looks so good. Be please be careful when you pick this up because you might it. lose the bottom. Yep. Cheers. Cheers. And we got our milk nearby. Mmm. Oh, that is chocolatey. Yeah, that's mm. good. That that is a chocolate lover's dream right there. Mmm. And I like it because it's handheld. And I don't have to go to a fancy restaurant to get a molten lava cake dessert. I just got my crumble cookie. cookies are handheld. I know, but when you get this at like a restaurant, they bring it to you in and you gotta have a spoon. To eat it, to cut it open, to have all the chocolate ooze out. So this is great because it's portable. Now that one's real good. For me, like when I make brownies, I like them to be just a 
you know, not really a tad runny, but underdone. You, you know what I'm saying? Underdone. And that, that's what this tastes like. The underdone part of a brownie, which is just the, my favorite part. So this, this was great. Still like moist. Yeah. But re hasn't really been chewy, but brownie dough like, and it, it has a little, it's just it's good. You're right, that a chocolate, chocolate lovers would love that. Again, that melted chocolate in the middle <coughs> was perfect. It's a handheld dessert. I mean, they're all handheld desserts. I mean, the powdered sugar on top. I mean, clearly just by looking at it, you know it's going to be the molten lava cake cookie. Yeah, and it's just super chocolatey. I mean, well done. I thought I was going to lose it and my bottom was going to fall out and my cookie was going to split open. But no, it actually held up together. Yep. So we good job it. on that one. That was super yummy. Going to have some deliberation here in a second. But we need milk. On to the aforementioned milk. Glass half full Cheers. or half empty? I'm a half empty person, apparently. Yeah, you are. I'm always full. See, this is where I said we need to be, like, immediately after we need to eat that chocolate, because that's when I drink this. See? Oh my gosh, look at this. The chocolate is oozing out of it. I got a little bit of chocolate. Now I drink the milk. Down the hatch. Wow, someone spilled over here this time on such baby milk. Oh. oh, I got chocolate on me. You got chocolate on me? I got me. chocolate got on me. On I got you. milk on me. You I am a, a hot cookie. mess. You are a cookie. I'm loving those cookies. They were good this week. Yep. On to deliberation. All right, we got some good ones to enjoy this week. So, boys, let's go ahead and uh, have another little quick snack of the pumpkin one from last week. Enjoy. Oh, it's very pumpkin -y. Good. Good, Good, yummy, delicious. All right, on to the cake batter. Is it good? I, I yeah. love cake batter things. I love cake batter too. Mm. Is this mm -hmm. like yes. cake batter with the uh, cookie? It's like a cake batter milkshake. Mm -hmm. It's really good cookie. I, 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 like, I like the sprinkles. I like, I like the cookie. I like the icing. It's delicious. Mm -hmm. Alright, chocolate peanut butter. Mm, good. That's good. It's good. Try peanut butter. Try peanut butter. It's chocolatey. Mm -hmm. peanut butter. Soft, breaking in. How do you like it? It has like chips in it. Like peanut butter chips. Yeah. And the chips are like melted. It's like, like my, mind you, it just like dissolves like away as you're biting it. It's a really good cookie. Mm -hmm. It is good. You get that um, little Reese's um, thing and then you have like the chocolate. It goes well together, but it's really chocolatey. Chocolate pistachio pie. Probably pistachio. Pistachio. It looks like the French soap pie was that, but it looks like it's chocolate and pistachio. It's good. I mean, I'm not a big fan of pistachio. That is interesting. It, 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 I, mean, I mean, it's a, it's a good cookie. It's good to get the vanilla cream cheese. With the chocolate um, cookie, it's good, but not one of my favorites. I think the French soap pie is better than this one. Mm -hmm. On to the cookie dough. I love cookie dough. Cookie dough is one of my favorite desserts to eat. Me too. I get a little bit of like milk into like the frosting. I get, 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 get a little bit of milk out from now. The cream cheese, me too. The frosting, very, very soft, light, cookie, soft, nice, humongous. It wasn't as good as last time because like this one, like it didn't taste as good as last time because like, last time it was delicious. Like I could go for it like several times but like this one's not as good as the last one 
I don't know why it would taste like milk. Like when I first been, I'm like, is this milk or something? And when I put first been, I'm like, why does this taste so much like milk? I don't know. Very odd. It is a cookie dough cream cheese icing, so okay. not milk. So I don't even know how I. I don't know. Okay. Your taste buds are off. Very off. On to the last one: molten lava cookie. Mmm. Mm. Oh, I like that one. The hot, the hot fun chocolate into the middle, fudge, fudge same thing. The chocolate cookie, the sugar on top. The, the cookie just like, it's not like this. It's like, it's not as big as some other cookies. Mm -hmm. It's flat. I like this one very much. Very cookie. Because you got the chocolate thing in the middle, so like every bite of it you get chocolate. Like sometimes, like this one, this is the cake batter. Sometimes you, you just bite this and you don't get any chocolate. Or like you don't get any icing. <coughs> but for this one you get icing because there's chocolate in the middle. So yeah, this one you get more like of the filling or something. Excellent. What's your favorite? I'm pointing at you. What's oh. your favorite? <laughs> Oh, the molten lava cake. Excellent. What's your favorite? Cake batter. Cake batter. Wonderful. And now it is time to wash it down with some tiny, tiny sips. Sip, sip, sip. Tiny sip time. Yeah. All right. Thanks, boys. Mm. All right. We have deliberated and we are in consensus. Coming in at number five was... The chocolate pistachio pie. Yeah, that... Honestly, that didn't need to be on there this week. We could have gone with four cookies, and I would have been jazzed. That was not a win. I mean, I, I love the way it looks. It's a beautiful cookie. It reminds me of a pie. I love how they do the pie cookies, and it's like with the cream or the custard it, in it. The, I love the way it's scalloped. The French like silk is better. Yeah, I love that French that silk That one's one. a good one. This one... Unless you're a pistachio fan, don't grab this one. It's I love pistachio, good. but I just didn't like the nuts in it. So yeah, it and I wish there was more of the, the 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 cream in it, the pistachio filling cream. I wish there was more in it. I got more cookie than than anything else. Yep. Anything else. So coming in at number four was the chocolate peanut butter chip cookie. Yep. Put some icing or cream cheese or something with peanut butter on it, and you have a win. Uh, it's just too much chocolate to not enough peanut butter. Yeah, just needed some more maybe peanut butter chips on it or peanut butter icing, which could have balanced it a little bit better. Mm -hmm. Coming in at number three. The cake batter cookie. That's good. Uh, I, You know, that one's going to be kids' favorites around. Oh, yeah. They're like, I love cake batter because cake batter is great. Um, that's a that was a good cookie. It did not make our list. No, but it's a good cookie. But it was our middle guy, so he's in the middle. Yeah, there's always one that's got to be like the middle child. Yep. You know, not not completely loved, not the baby, just right there in the middle, just doing its own thing, loving life. Okay, moving on. All right, number two. Oops, I messed up. The cookie dough cookie. Great cookie. Love it. It hit our list at number 25. So it's probably not going to be there long, but that is a wonderful cookie. You know what I'm noticing? What? A lot of these, like, cookies are already desserts, like this week. We had cake batter, cookie dough. Like, they're already desserts. Yes, you have figured out the theme. Yes, there was a theme this week. It's desserts into cookies. And molten lava. Yes, that was the theme this week. Yes. Desserts turned into cookies. I love it. Yes. I love these. I, I'm hoping for Halloween they don't just go, you know what? Let's do a Snickers cookie and a Reese's cookie and a Kit Kat cookie. I understand Halloween candy, but come on. No, let's get more creativity. No. I want some fall flavors. Crumble's going to have something good for Halloween. And, and I, I know you love putting the sugar cookie with the little colorful, oh, look, it's Halloween. No, it's just a sugar cookie. Come I on. I think that's a good go-to. It's no, a safe cookie. No, no, I want. I want. You want festive? Throw, throw me a curveball with some pumpkin that day. That oh, would be great. Oh, moving on. For those of you that haven't realized what our number one cookie number was, number one, the molten lava cookie. Delicious. So it was 
chocolate lover's dream. So make sure you wonderful. have milk with you. Probably eat it as soon as you get it because it is warm. And yes. that chocolate is probably like oozing out of the cookie when you bite into it. So it's good. It made number 23 on our list. So it, it uh, hopefully will be around for a couple of weeks. So, Unless something really amazing pops up. I don't know. I have I have very high expectations that we're going to get some really good ones with Halloween coming around the corner. Man, I'm, I'm hoping so. So yeah, There were two winners this week, a third that was a possible, and then two that were just... <laughs> Can't win them all. Don't need the... <laughs> but overall, good week, Crumble Cookie. Thank you. Good job. We enjoyed them. All right, another good week of cookies. So did you guys enjoy it? Uh-huh. Yep. Excellent. There were some good flavors and Lots some, of chocolate some not week. good flavors, but overall I think it was a good week, right? Mm -hmm. I can honestly say that was probably a lot of chocolate this week. That was a lot I mean, of chocolate. That was a lot of chocolate. Little, I never thought I would say too that. too much chocolate. chocolate. Yeah, we love chocolate and we're, that's the same yeah. much when we said there was a lot of chocolate. Yes, we need to have a little bit more balance of crumble. We need um, ones. But some were really good. Yes. Uh, but for us, I would say, Ben. Mayor. Done that. See you next time. Bye.